Hey guys, it's Candice of La Dose Vita Fashion Fix. Um, I just want to check in with you guys really quickly. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed Thanksgiving and that it was a lot of great times filled with family, friends, and food. My three favorite things. And um, I just wanted to tell you all really quickly that I was recently featured in a Black Friday shopping story for the New York Post, which is where I work. And um, this was my first time ever being photographed in the paper in any type of spread. So it was really amazing and really fun. I got a chance to run around the city amongst all the crazy tourists trying to rack up a whole bunch of deals. And I just wanted to show it to you all really, really quickly. This is me. Okay. And I picked up a Marc Jacobs cardigan, Banana Republic um sweater, some Levi jeans, a Cole Haan bag, and some Tracy Reef boots. And I saved uh, about $400. So that was really fun. Um, if you don't live in New York City, I will provide the link below um, so that you can check it out on the web. Um, other than that, I did a little bit of shopping this weekend. I stopped in Zara and I also stopped in the Mac store. I'm not really a big shopper, but I guess I was feeling the holiday spirit and I just wanted to, I don't know, pick up something new. So I headed into Zara and I found these shoes. Okay, these babies are from the TRF collection. And as you can see, the heel is hot pink leather and the um, rest of the shoe is patent leather. And these were originally... $49.90 and I got them for $19.99 yes I love my cheap clothes and yeah I love deals so um, as I was heading out and heading on to check out I found this um, chocolate Zara woman um, perfume and it really does smell like chocolate and if you know me you know I am a chocolate fiend I eat chocolate every day <laughs> so after that, I headed into the MAC store and I checked out the um, new Matchmaster foundation. And here it is in 9.0. And I love this foundation so far. It's really, really good. It does what it says. It does match your complexion. It has a nice powdery, powdery finish. And it's, it's a beautiful color. It's a beautiful shade. It truly matches my skin complexion. Um, ever since the summertime ended, my skin has just been in between light and dark. So this is really helping me out. Um, I also wanted to get a nice nude everyday type of lip and this is a great option that I picked it up. I picked out um, Touch Lipstick. It's a luster. It's like a brownish nude. And on top of that I have uh, the Glitter and Ice, the new collection um, Dazzle Glass. And this is like my first Dazzle Glass and I really like it. Um, so again I want to have a complete review for you. Um, all of those products on the blog and make sure you guys are subscribed subscribe to the YouTube channel as well as the blog www.ldvfashionfix.com and if you have any questions or comments or concerns just let me know um, pre-fill to email me at info at ldvfashionfix.com and I will definitely return your um, question and also I'm going to review these Zoya nail polishes. I should have done so weeks ago. I won these um, in a, a giveaway from Carmen of LipstickFashionMascara.com and this is the Smoke and Mirrors collection. Um, but other than that, you guys, it's been a fun week. I mean, I was featured in the New York Post. Like, I know that's my paper, but I mean, it's very rare that, you know, you get that type of opportunity. And of course, I had to grab it. Hello. Um, but yeah, I feel like, you know, 2012 has a lot in store and I'm really, truly looking forward to it. And if you're wondering about my look really quickly, um, I have a braid out that, you know, I twist it into a little bun. I have a little sequin headband, have a, you know, fun t-shirt on, just real casual laid back. And as far as my makeup is concerned, I have on the Matchmaster Foundation in 9.0 and I have on the lip, uh, that I just told you about and finished it off with Black Opal's Deluxe Finishing Powder. I have on the Wet n Wild Berry Shimmer um, blush that I talked about in my last video and Falsies Mascara, the Revlon Colorstay Eye Pen and 
that's about it. Oh, also my NARS Illuminator. Can't forget that. So if you guys have any questions, just let me know. And until next time, bye.